Good morning, everybody. Happy Wednesday. Um, I'm making sourdough bread. I'm making sourdough starter right now. Hello. Okay, so it is Wednesday morning. It's about 10 a.m. I gotta head out here shortly. I'm gonna go donate some blood. Um, I always, I feel like I've said this a bunch, but if you're new, I, I donate blood as, as often as I can. I am uh, a very common blood type, which, or I'm a blood type that's in demand a lot, essentially. So I do my, I do everything I can to stay like as, as healthy as possible to, and as easy as hell for me to give blood. I don't have any of the issues that a lot of other people struggle with. Um, and yeah, so I just feel like it's like my, one of the things that I feel, you know, pulled to do. Anyway, so I'm gonna go do that today. I always try to do it around the holidays just because, you know, it's needed. Uh, it's a different way to spread, to spread some holiday cheer. Um, I also have Alyssa coming today to help me prep for the holiday party. Uh, we're gonna work on, I just checked the weather. It's not supposed to rain, but looking at the house, there's no way in hell you're gonna convince me that it's not gonna rain. So I still have like a week and a half, but there's a lot of work to do. And there's a lot of other things going on between now and then as well. So I'm just taking chunks of time where I can. Uh, so she's gonna help me on the interior of the house today um, as much as possible. Other thing, if I can, I might not be able to do this today, but I, I, have, a, um, I have a Land Rover Defender. Uh, like a 1995 UK import defender. Her name is Beatrix. She's my farm truck. Uh, but she's right hand drive, which is fine, but she's an automatic. Uh, and she's 30 years old, almost 30 years old. So, uh, I'm, I'm like learning how to drive her. And so I should do that today if I have time. That's kind of the problem that I bump into is I just don't have time. Or if I do, it's like, I have to like create the dogs, blah, blah, blah. It's just kind of a lot. So I tend to do it on days where Jeremy's home or whatever, and he's at home. So it's definitely something I'd like to dedicate, you know, at least like 30 minutes to an hour on. Uh, I like to do, uh, it's also one of those things that just gets pushed back. Cause it's like, ugh. Anyway, so that's on my, like, I'd love to get this done today, but I have also a 51 things on my to-do list today. So we'll see. Um, and I had to send a package out for Jeremy while I'm out. So lots to do lots to do so my outfit today like is kind of comical so these are the a goldie nico jeans i have them in all of my in between sizes since i gained weight um i'm normally like a 27 these i don't even know i bought them in like every bridge size that i fit um and i just put a pair on <laughs> uh this is actually from nordstrom kids section this is like a dress for children but it's a top on me because my boobs are huge uh but it's so cute it's a janice shopkin shirt uh so i had to get it and apparently i can wear a kids like size 16 so that's good <laughs> So, home, was donated, dropped off Jeremy's package. Now I'm unboxing wine, which is like one of the more fun things that I get to learn. Um, I made the switch kind of very casually, non-intentionally to natural wines this year uh, because we're gonna put in a vineyard on the property. And that's the kind of wine I'm like out of breath because I just did that like gate thing like three times. Um, that's the kind of wine that I'm going to be making. Uh, it's like low intervention, spontaneous fermentation, all that kind of stuff. So because of the puppy, this is like part of a bigger thing. Because of the puppies, I can't go for my sommelier right now because I don't have protected time because they are a lot of work. Um, but what I figured I would do in the interim is at least revise and break down my palette so I truly understood like what it was that I was liking versus what I thought it was um and that has basically gotten me to where I'm at where I get um deliveries monthly from some from a 
a company called Dry Farm Wines. This isn't an ad at all. I fucking wish it was. Um, but yeah, so they're, they send me, you can get a bunch of different stuff, but I get um, tw a mixed case. So I get 12, a high blend of red and white. And then I get six sparkling. So I get about 18 bottles a month. Because we have parties, my host, and I bring wine to people and all that kind of shit. But one of the things I do is I keep an inventory on my phone. I keep a phone note of what I have, from where, what kind. So that way, when I'm pulling wine for dinner or for something, I'm making a more intentional decision. And I'm not just being like, well, I saw that one first. Um, yeah. So it's great. And it also kind of teaches you a lot. They've got an app and everything. So if you are into learning about wine, it's kind of interesting. Um, you, you find yourself going down some rabbit holes. But anyway, so... This one's tomorrow. Okay. I'm going to let Alyssa do the honors. <gasps> so those are... What are those? Snickerdoodle holiday shapes. Ooh. Those are new. Ooh. Ready? Sit like a good boy. Sit. No, sir. Off. Sit. Oh, it's back here. Sit, sit. Sit. Oh, very smart. Snickerdog. You just drop it so she didn't bite you. Oh, that's so good. I love it. Sit. Oh, good boy. Sit. Oh, very smart. Good job. These actually look pretty good. I know. Their ingredients aren't bad. Oh my god, how cute. Yeah. Little, look at it. I got that for you, friend. <laughs> One more. Sit. Sit. Oh, very smart. Very smart. Oh, he's gonna get chunky. Okay. Four more. One for everybody. Ladies for me. <laughs> I don't care. Who's the one that hasn't, who's had the least? Yeah, give it to her. Yay, all done. She's not, she's had her meds. She actually ate enough breakfast so she could have her meds this morning. So she's had her chemo and her, um, Vedderol. All done. It's empty. All done. There's, so there's toys in there too, but it's hysterical because they get like, oh, we don't want that. And then they'll, they'll, they'll yeah, yeah. So they'll come for it like later. Uh, but so we have two of these things, which has actually worked out really well. So on toy days, I have a backup Yeah. because now they're like, they're going to be so pissed come January. <laughs> Mom, New Year sucks. <laughs> Off. Off. Yeah, but it's 12. So we do them every other day. So we've got one, three, two. So do, I guess do four. Oh, I don't know. I gotta sit like this. Go ahead, do four. Plus, is excited about cheese. Whoa, that looks cool. I love me a cool rind. Wednesday okay. dill with juicy cranberry. Fested with something, honey, and prosciutto. With something. Have the waistband. Okay, now look at this. You're lying. Open, open. Wait. <gasps> what? I know. <laughs> <laughs> so I have day six still, and we have day seven. So this will tell you, so that way you can see. Marcona almond date, medjool date filled with Spanish Marcona almond roasted in olive oil, sea salt, marzipan, dark chocolate, adorned with 24 karat gold leaf. Mm -hmm. And then what's the seven? Peppermint candy cane gnome. See, it's fun, isn't it? That is so fun. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, this cool. beats the daylights out of last year's candy ones our taco ones last year were nowhere near as good as this one so i said instead of getting like three or four let's just or i think we probably have like five let's get so one good. really great one yeah. and it's paid off in spades 
but you we didn't even way. know this lit up or played music. Yeah, Coco accidentally that? knocked it and was <laughs> like, "Oh, it's playing music." <laughs> and then Jeremy was like, "And it lights up," and I'm like, "This is awesome." Because it's heavy. You yeah, can't, yeah, yeah. And these are like fresh made, so you have to keep it in the fridge. That's so cool. yeah. That's the gold leaf we're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> I know. Don't get too excited. I was excited. expecting the whole thing. You were expecting that, like, I gotta opulence. Oh, my God. Look at the little gnome. That's cute. And then look at the back of them. <laughs> what is it? What does it say? What's on this? Almond date. I'm going to have to use a knife or something for this one. That's fine. That's what I've been doing. Huh? Mm-hmm. Here you go. It's solid. It is very solid. These dogs are pissed. No chocolate for you. Mm mm. It's because we love you. I need to cook it up in the Oh, yeah. Mmm. This is a lot. I don't want that. Hold on. That doesn't look like. Then what's in the middle? A date? But then what's that? That's not a date. That's the date, right? Oh, almond? Oh, it's like jelly. Is it good? Let's see. Marcona. Oh. Marzipan. Mm. And then chocolate. Mm. Pretty good. It doesn't pair well with that. Uh -huh. That's too strong. That is dark chocolate, right? Mm -hmm. I think so. Mmm. You got the marshmallow. That's good, huh? I'm not a big marshmallow enthusiast. I think I like it. You do? Mm hmm. Of course you know. I like that. It's just fun, though, right? Really fun. Mm hmm. <laughs> <laughs> this is how you make a whole season out of it. I don't know about juicy cranberry cheese, though. Maybe on toast. Mm. Or, um. I don't think I like sweet cheese. You don't like sweet cheese? I don't think so. I have strawberry goat cheese in the fridge. That's a no? Mm-mm. Okay. Mm -mm. Should I just put this in that fridge or yeah. keep it in this? Okay. No, I'm going to put that out. Otherwise, that way dad knows because dad likes that. This is like his thing. He likes that one and he likes the jam ones. Mm -hmm. Okay, oh, yeah, I think it's everything else. We're just really, we're early on this one today. Normally I wait until the end of the day. I'm real tired. Um, I don't want to eat blood. Um, normally I sit down for a little bit. I did not do that. I'm feeling that. So maybe a little sugar will help. What's up? So they're looking for a toy that they can't find. Where is it? Um, they've been looking for about two minutes. Did you find it? No. Where is it, Duke Duke? Where is it? Where is it, June? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? They know where is it. They know what that means. They know they have to go find it. It's just, this is literally one of the cutest things ever. Duke actually takes it really seriously and will like find it no matter what. So he's, he's like thoroughly looking. It's, where is it? Where is it? So if you put your hands up in the air 
And I say, where is it? He knows what that means. And now June knows what that means. Well, he will get there. I think you're gonna find a new toy, guys. I can't, I don't know if you're gonna find it. Look at, look at, look at. He's like, <laughs> oh my God, I love him. He's a good boy. He's a good boy, Duke Duke. He's a good boy. Did you find it, June? No. Oh no, we gotta find a new toy, huh? We lost the ball, huh? Oh boy. Oh boy.